The following message is being transmitted at the request of the Department of Homeland Security. Residents in the city of Nashville, return to your homes immediately. A massive swarm of flying parasites are headed towards the city of Nashville. The parasites have caused extensive damage to the city of Hopkinsville. FEMA has set up emergency shelters in the city of Nashville. Any civilians who wish to go to the emergency shelters are advised to head to one immediately. Bring enough food, water, clothing, medical supplies, and a battery-powered radio. The following agents will be dispatched into the city. X and James. The swarm of parasites will arrive in the next 30 minutes. Take cover now. Stay tuned for more updates as they become available. The following message is being transmitted at the request of the Department of Homeland Security. The flying parasites have landed in the city of Nashville. X is currently engaging the parasites with his pistol. James is currently throwing grenades at large groups of parasites. Military officials are being dispatched to assist the agents in handling the situation. If you have not gone to an emergency shelter, local authorities will lead you to one. Follow directions given out by local authorities. Do not interfere with the ongoing fight. You will be putting your life in extreme danger. The following message is being transmitted at the request of the Department of Homeland Security and the Federal Emergency Management Agency. An individual was last seen taking out the flying parasites over the city of Nashville. The individual's name is Drake, a 25-year-old Caucasian male, standing at 6 feet tall, weighing in at 159 pounds, with black hair and red eyes. He was last seen wearing a black coat, gray pants, and black boots. He was last seen carrying a rocket launcher, which he is using to shoot down the parasites. Any civilians evacuating to the emergency shelters are advised to do so quickly. Stay away from Drake at all times. Stay tuned for more updates as they become available. The following message is being transmitted at the request of the Department of Homeland Security and the Federal Emergency Management Agency. A group of parasites have landed in the city of Jackson. Civil authorities will be transporting civilians to the emergency shelters set up by FEMA. Bring enough food, water, clothing, medical supplies, and a battery-powered radio. Follow directions given out by civil authorities. The following agents will be dispatched into the city. Johnny, and Bridget. Stay tuned to this or other media outlets for the latest information as it becomes available. The following message is being transmitted at the request of the Federal Emergency Management Agency. Military officials continue to fight off the parasites roaming throughout the city of Jackson. 
Johnny continues to assist military officials in taking out the parasites. Bridget is now neutralizing the flying parasites over the city of Jackson. Civilians are advised that it is now too late to evacuate to the emergency shelters. The parasites have a heightened sense of hearing and smell, and will be able to find you if you fail to hide. Take cover underground immediately. Barricade all entrances to your shelter. Do not make loud or sudden noises. If a parasite manages to get into your shelter, do not attempt to aggravate it. Remain completely still until the parasite leaves your shelter. Stay tuned for more updates as they become available. The following message is being transmitted at the request of the Jackson Fire Department. A massive explosion has occurred inside the Jackson Fire Department Station 4. The building has been set on fire. Multiple parasites have been destroyed in the explosion. A suspect has left the scene shortly after the explosion. The suspect has been identified as 22-year-old Darwin Anderson. Darwin is a white male, standing at 5 feet 9 inches tall, Weighing in at 135 pounds, with dark red hair and orange eyes. He was last seen wearing red armor, a red jacket, dark red pants, and black boots. Darwin is capable of creating large fires at will. If you see Darwin in your area, do not approach him. The Jackson Fire Department Station 1 has been called out to put out the fire. Stay tuned for more updates as they become available. The following message is being transmitted at the request of the Department of Homeland Security. At this time, all civilians must be in an underground shelter now. The parasites continue to roam throughout the city of Bowling Green. Military officials, as well as members of SWAT, are being dispatched to destroy the parasites. Bobby will be dispatched to assist military officials in exterminating the parasites. Take cover now. Head underground and put as many objects between you and the outside world. Bring enough food, water, clothing, medical supplies, and a battery-powered radio for your stay in your shelter. If a parasite manages to get in- The following message is being transmitted at the request of the Department of Homeland Security. A truck containing toxic waste has exploded in the city of Bowling Green. The parasites exposed to the toxic materials have mutated into larger parasites. These mutant parasites can be identified with the following characteristics. Increased height, large mouths with sharpened teeth, spines on most of their bodies, tendrils, ranging from 4 to 8. Sharpened claws excessive drooling, and very poor posture. Bobby has been exposed to the toxic materials, and has mutated along with the parasites. However, Bobby still has control of his own body, and is currently engaging the parasites. If you see a parasite in your area, do not aggravate it. Remain hidden from the general public at all times. Please stand by and await further instructions. We interrupt our programming. 
This is a law enforcement warning. At around 11 o'clock a.m. Central Standard Time, two individuals were last seen assisting Bobby in taking out the parasites. The first individual has been identified as 22-year-old Darwin Anderson. The second individual has been identified as 21-year-old Luis Reyes. Luis is a Hispanic male, standing at 5 feet 9 inches tall, weighing in at 137 pounds, with dark blue hair and blue eyes. He was last seen wearing blue armor, a blue trench coat, blue pants, and blue boots. Luis is carrying a harpoon gun, which he is using to shoot down the parasites. He also has the ability to manipulate water at will. Darwin is the same individual who set a fire station on fire in Jackson, Tennessee. The three individuals are currently in a standoff with the mutant parasites. Please stand by and await further instructions.